Well, those who are against this Confederate monument feel like they're back at square one, and those who wanted to keep it here are celebrating. Now, the board chair wanted to make it clear tonight that they had no other choice but to rescind the resolution from earlier this month. Tensions are high after the Gaston County Board of Commissioners voted four to three to rescind the resolution that would have given the Sons of Confederate Veterans ownership of this monument. The board says after the August 3rd meeting, they were informed by SCV that they wouldn't be taking over the statue's deed. When the Sons of Confederate Veterans decided that they did not want to take it, you have to rescind it. It's actually moot. I spoke with the attorney of the organization and they say they sent this letter to the board detailing how moving the monument would violate North Carolina General Statues 100-2.1. Those against the statue moving are glad it's staying put for now. Tearing them down and replacing them, people aren't going to understand what's going on. They're not. They're just going to think that it's all bad. And that's not what we need to teach our kids. However, other residents are not so happy. They say the board is playing with fire. And at this point, the board cannot be trusted. I've been out here trying to make sure that we do things in a safe manner. I've been trying to talk people down from more radical action. But now what can I say to them? So whatever happens, happens. Now, it's not clear at this point what is next for the board, but the people out here protesting earlier today say they hope to get a clarification from them soon. Reporting live in Gaston County, Linnea Lewis, Fox 46, getting results. Okay.